Eric Veloagia. He's on a mission. Uh, Carpenter's glue. Yeah. So we'll go do that. Hopefully that'll help build up his... Uh, Hey, then the Allied Industries. Does that have something in it? No. Uh, hopefully that'll help build up his friendship level or whatever you'd like to call it. Okay. Need turn around, go the other way. Man, it's been forever since I've actually, you know, played this. I'd like to actually sit down and play some of the old game as well. Just just like the just the whole feature of being able to, to store rut sacks in a a vehicle. I guess you could, you could probably clean out an area really fast as far as like materials and stuff go, and get just like, ouch. I mean, just really get your you just build up your supplies that much faster. A couple of games, like I said, I've been playing some Dark Souls too, where I've been. Like I, said, I played a uh, um, da 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 da. -da. Shadow Run Return. If you've never played that game, it's kind of a uh, isometric style turn-based RPG. It has like orcs, elves, and things like that, but it's cyberpunk. And if that's something you're into, definitely pick it up. It's good stuff. Uh, there's like the normal game, and then you have some DLC out called Dragonfall, which is excellent. The normal game's good, but the Dragonfall DLC is really, really cool. And there's just all kinds of, you know, all kinds of goody stuff if you're into that cyberpunk stuff. Which I am, I like it. Hopefully it may be, of course I doubt it, at E3, which is going to be happening in the next couple of days. Whoa. Ran past a dude here. Is uh, we'll actually get to see some of that cyberpunk 2075. Thanks for the assist. I found a freak and I could use a hand taking it down. A bloated said? That's no problem. Actually, yeah, it's back there where I thought it would. And that look kind of like through the wall industrial area where there's a. It's kind of like it's weird because we have like this big stone wall here, and then there's like a. Or maybe did I imagine it? Or I'm, I'm probably at the wrong. No, no, here it is. Yeah, it's like right here. There's like just one random door on this wall, and then you can get into these buildings. That's thought it was kind of weird. I was pulling up a little bit. There we go. Now we just gotta kill a bloater, I believe is what he said. So That will be no problem at all, as long as I can... Oh yeah, there's an infestation. Maybe not as easy as I thought. Just have to be... Be timid around here. I'm glad you got my back, dude. Oh, I actually found some carpenter's glue. Well, that that worked out good. Wasn't what I really wanted, but Let's see, is this that's a blunt weapon too. Nice four pounds. I still got rusty pop still in good shape. There's still a lot of stuff like when I was playing through. I broke one of those industrial wrenches, and just doesn't make any damn sense how I could I could break that. And a torque wrench? I needed a torque wrench as well. Whoa. Okay, looks like we got some serious fighting in there. Get off me. Whoa. God damn. Don't let them have. Ah, damn it. You piece of shit. Get off me. I was just gonna tell it, dude. Don't let them have your back, and then one of them grabs me from behind. Okay. Pop some pills. Now, what was I doing? Was I searching this? Okay, what we got here? Got a rifle and a hoe. Oh, that worked out good. Boom. Taken care of. Looks like there's going to be quite a bit of materials here. And we are definitely in the middle of an infestation. Okay, gas. We will run this out to the car. Alright. Yeah, it seems like the 
area next to me, which is the, uh, I think it's one of the, it's either one of the sniper ones or mercenary uh, places that you can set as an outpost. And that will actually, it'll either give you sniper fire or uh, some mercenaries that you can hire. Oh, excellent find there. I should net me about 30 building materials. There's still one thing I dislike. <laughs> I mean, in the other games, you you make like certain outposts. You know, when you make an outpost, it, it give it feeds your base. Like if you make an outpost that has food, you get snacks and stuff, and it's supposed to, you know, your, it reduces your daily. Uh, oh, hello, guys! You decided to find me. There we go. Uh, taking care of that. Nothing left. All right. They they give you like things throughout the day, or throughout each day. Like if you get a gas station, you got gas in it, you get a little bit of fuel every day. And eventually, if you get enough things right, you can offset your daily needs through that. But in this, it doesn't really seem to be the case. Like, okay, new location is good. Alright. Can I establish an outpost here? I need an outpost on this location ASAP. Oh, I can. Excellent. So I can go ahead and do that. Now, see, when you lose, uh, there's there's one part in the game you'll actually, because I'm talking, talking to that place called Doghouse or whatever, there is a point you'll actually lose contact with them, and then you'll lose, because you notice all the stuff I can do right here. I have access to all that. But whenever I lose Doghouse, I will lose all that. I will, I will lose that access, so going through and making these certain little areas like that outpost allows me to get those abilities again. And I believe that truck up there's got some materials in it too. This place was ripe with some good old stuff. Good stuff. I don't believe I see one in it. There he is. And he's dead. Don't you leave me yet. We gotta kill some fuckers first. Oh no, my rusty pipe's getting ready to... Don't you run off my... Oh, lame, dude. Help me fight these gang boys. God damn it. Last time I do a favor for you. Let's see how many they are. Eat it, fat man. I wish this thing had an optic on it so I can get a little bit of zoom. I got six silent shots left. Okay, that was a lucky hit. I have a feeling my pipe's getting ready to break here in a second. And then I'll have nothing but my Kung Fu to defend my country. Okay, well, that worked out pretty good. Unless there's... We've got company here. I hear just a... Put your dumb ass up. There you go. Whoa. That's some serious hairdo there. I do just a blue belt. Sweet. Medicine out the ass. You know, I don't think I'll have enough room in my car to actually fix everything. Medicine's good, though. Actually, hold on a second. Let me... Let me go ahead and just break that, and I'll go pick up one of these uh, other, I think there's uh, some tools in this toolbox I can use as a melee weapon. Uh, the hose, a heavy weapon, uh, the 40 caliber, I would like to actually like to have that, just because I like collecting guns. Okay, we'll switch to the lead pipe then. I guess that's an upgrade, a rusty pipe upgraded to a lead pipe, yeah, I guess. Okay, medicine. That. I think they were one more thing of medicine, and then just a still a butt ton to actually you know check out. They might be all kinds of good stuff up in there. So yeah, as I was saying earlier about the, the bases, the outposts, they would give you daily supplies each day, and in this it, I, it still kind of does the same, but it's really I don't I don't know. I mean, 
there's a point where you can actually call in your base and say, hey, give me building materials and they'll just send it to you. Of course, it does cost quite a bit of uh, renown. But there was one point I was, I mean, I was rocking like almost 3,000 renown and I wasn't really even doing anything. Can I get... Uh, no room for that. Can I use it? Well... Dead, take it. Okay, now I do like stripping the places clean. So, all right, this place is done. Let's see, like, where did those guys come from? I believe there's some stuff up in that truck. No, yeah, actually there is. One thing I will say is that I really feel vulnerable being out by my out by myself like this. I really feel like I could get gibbed at any time. And I guess that's a good thing, if that's what you're going for. Oh, got good guns. Got a Scorpion Evo and an AK-47, I believe. AK-74. Might have to come back for those. I don't know. What can I destroy? Uh, decisions, decisions. Uh, you know what? I never really had a problem with bullets last time around. So... We're just going to destroy those. Uh, this this gun. Pistol. Screw it. I will take both of those. Grenades. Eh, I will keep my... Like I said, I never had a problem with bullets last, last time around. I did have a problem with healing materials there towards the end. So we'll keep a bottle of Tylenol. Yeah, I guess my, my threat level has not gone up, so as, maybe as long as I don't go pick up that woman, then I won't get raided again. If, if that's the case, then you better believe I'm going to stock up on everything. Alright, anyway. We're going to take this back to the house. Let me set up. Oops, no, that's not what I want. Let's go ahead and return this back to the house. I need to kind of avoid where that lady's at. For a while, I will eventually do it, but I want to actually build my base up and maybe have it prepared and trained up some of my guys. If I could do that, then that would actually be a pretty cool thing to do. I mean, at least my guys will be prepared and I have a better chance because it gets rough. I mean, there's, there's just like you're constantly ping ponging back and forth between gates. Maybe. Yeah, right there. See, like this, this right here, that coach. Uh, Kills a man cave. Yeah, that, there's a bunch of guns in there. I'll leave it as it is right now because actually, I'm not, and there's nothing on those. So there's not a lot of zombies out. Not a lot out at all. Okay, well I said I spoke too soon because there was a shit ton just pinged up on the damn map right there. Oh gosh. All right. I'm gonna get down here. And hopefully get, I believe it was the storeroom that was the problem. It was the storage room that needed some glue for whatever reason. I guess I'm going to have to build a generator. I mean, the first time I did, I built the generator and, and then I had the, uh, you know, I actually researched solar power. Wait a minute, this ain't my stop. I researched the solar power, done all that, and... It just, and then I got, you know, like I said, I, by then I had everything really built up, so the whole, you know, power tools and making stuff being built faster just really didn't seem to matter. I don't know. Let's whip it right in here. And kilos, good. Yeah, look at that, we're, we are maxed out on food. Be decent on first aid, bullets, I need bullets, we got good building materials, and we got decent gas. <laughs> Everybody needs decent gas. <laughs> Alright. Tired. Alright, need to drop this here. This is the workroom. First time I put the shitter, it was like right here. <laughs> Which is kind of funny because everybody's just kind of walking back and forth, and just <laughs> it's hilarious actually. You see these two porta potties, and then, then you know, 
I wouldn't want to be the dude just sitting right here, or whoever it was, just taking the shit. <laughs> and then you got to look over to see this dude, back like, what's up, or, you know, whoever. <laughs> I'm sure the ladies would like that quite a bit. Another thing that's actually funny is, like, you actually have to clean out the toilet every so often, because... You got something fixed? Yeah, every so often it'll be like, oh, the latrine needs to be cleaned, you know? <laughs> Alright, what we... Oh, we got something else we need to get here? What's this? Did I pick it up as well? I must have. What is... Okay, I guess so, yeah. Hmm. Work can continue. Danger. Big inciting and a bloated Zed sighting. Hold up. Alright, let's see. Okay, officer. Still not my friend. I will switch up to her. And... He's relaxed. This person is frustrated. And with a name like that, I'd be frustrated too. Uh, Alright, we're going to switch up to her. This is Didi. Didi, what we got here? You got an assault rifle MK16 Mod Zero. Let's have a look at that. Let's have a look. Actually, it looks more like a scar. And we're going to call that a scar. Maybe they couldn't call it a scar. But that's a scar. Looks pretty good. Got the optic on it. So I need a little bit of zoom. Oh, it's either a two round burst. Okay, there we go. Boom, boom, boom. Good. Two round burst, three, or one shot. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Go ahead and dump that. I really need to find some my guys some backpacks. Keep the baton for right now. Do 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 do. All right, got her some main stuff. All right, guys. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut this video off right here, and we're gonna pick it back up in a little bit, and we're gonna take Dee Dee out. And we're gonna kill some biggins and some bloated Zeds. Until then, we'll see you then.